Hello everyone, thank you so much for clicking this video. I'm Sander here Wale and in this film today I want to show you the making of this surpass. The surpass you just is what I will be showing you the making process of it and what interests me in making this is that the uh, student in the workshop makes it from a leftover pieces. The, 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 the leftover material in the workshop is what he used in making this and that's where I decided to just bring it for you and let you see how he was able to use all these pieces material and come out with something excellent so right in here is going to be making it and this video is fast speed so if you don't like the speed the play speed of it not comfortable with it go to the youtube site and reduce to the play speed you are comfortable with so coming up right now has to get this these are some of our production leftover my rubber we, we have this in the workshop so we have to now retrieve it to the shape at which it wants after i get to retrieve it it needs to pick another piece of leather that it needs to use in covering off the surface of the rubber. So we'll be covering up, applying this on the surface of rubber right now. The elevation, stripping the surface of the rubber for it to be ready to pick up the gum very well. And at the time we done, apply cementing glue to this and clip the leather and the rubber all together mount pressure on it so at this point it has done with the inner sole of it and having it made the premier so earlier so this is set the next thing is doing going to be doing right now is to get the material it's going to be using for the upper set it's using a, a fabric a fabric every account print fabric to be precise and african fabric cannot be just can you can't just use it alone you have to use it with leathers for it to have a bit of strength so what it's going to do right now is doing right now is to then give it cement it all together uh to have a bit of strength and in press of the cementing you have to be very careful the way you do yours because the African fabric it is a fabric and applying glue on it which is a liquid that can be soaked so you have to apply it gently for it not to penetrate to the other side for you not to dent the actual look of the project properly glue together right now then it's time to then Cut it all together is just making the basic as the image I was showing earlier is just making the basic super as a form of sander. It's just stripes, so you need to cut these stripes out right in here. Cut the stripes out at the time you cut the stripes out, it clips the tips of the stripe all together to make that tiny stripes you see on the preview image earlier. After getting the hub I said the next thing is to then come and last it all together. Last thing is that process at which you get this that you've just done to shape and size. So to get that you have to the material has to be embedded in the sole to have a proper grip. So that is what we're gonna be doing right now. Gonna make up the holes in it, the holes, make up the holes, cut off the holes and then in, insert all the leather stripes, fabric stripes, I beg your pardon and it right now so it's going to be embedded in it and then with a couple of gum i'm going to apply gum in it that's going to hold before we then proceed to cementing the upper layer and the last sew together
this is not completely last then last right now the next thing is going to be doing right now is that you're going to be cementing the upper layer and the sole together so the last the mid sole and the last is we're going to be putting together right now so why you put that you have to consider the gum you're going to be applying using for that you apply the two together after you apply gum on it wait for it to dry for a particular of time depending on the gum you're using plus read the description of the gum to know the timing that you're going to be using to hold on for a while for it to dry so at the time you've put all that together then the project is set it's set you have to arrange it pull it up glue it together and while you glue it make sure it's all accurate it's not one-sided it's accurate and then you hammer it man pressure on it and then proceed to the bench going to make the edges balance hope you like what you've seen don't forget share like and subscribe when you subscribe click on the notification bell for you to be notified on a subsequent upload on this platform i'm your only son and this video is credited to oko sunday made completely in the workshop lagos nigeria look forward to have you in a subsequent upload